hello beautiful people welcome back to my channel it's your girl star flames and if you're new here be sure to go ahead hit that subscribe button turn on your notification bell and join the family so guys in this video we're talking about travis scott and young sweet rule again because this drama as i've said because travis scott responded this drama will not end i knew it shouldn't have responded to this young lady it should have gotten someone to sit down with a media outlet and write an article about this no travis scott said that he did not know this young lady young sweet roe aka um her government name not aka her government name is regine carr um after travis scott said that he doesn't know her regine made a video saying you know what you guys have been telling me to keep quiet and i've been doing everything that you guys asked me to do so what you're not gonna do sir is tell a lie that you know i'm making up stuff so after that travis scott was still being a damn drama queen like he's so i mean why is he fighting for the public to believe him so much if he knows that he hasn't been doing this, he should just ignore whatever else she's coming with. But no, he's not going to do that. So he posts again on Instagram. If you wasn't at this table on V-Day, then you wasn't with me. No. Was that necessary? In my opinion, this was totally unwarranted. Travis Scott is going out on a limb to try and prove his innocence but he's only gonna find himself ending up in a ditch from these allegations he needs to let this young lady say whatever she has to say because providing that this lady actually has all those videos and photos the more he pushes her the more she will want to release all of that information now after Travis Scott posted that if you weren't at this table on VD, then you wasn't with me, um, Young Sweet Bro clapped back at Travis Scott. Now, what you are seeing on the screen might be a bit confusing to you, but I'm going to explain it. Now, if, depending on how your screen is set up, on one side, you're going to see a image, right? On that image, that's where Young Sweet Bro is alleging that she and Travis Scott hang out on Valentine's Day. And after that, Travis Scott left for Gunna's party. No, she also said in that message that Travis Scott may have taken too much mal mal. And as such, Travis Scott's brain is scrambled, so he's not able to remember. No, on the other side, you can see where is because she initially said that Travis Scott was eating up all these people, her friends, you know, getting her friends to ask her to come out. And I think that's the time when she said they weren't on speaking terms. So those messages, I believe, those are the messages that she's showing. Now, I don't know who this person is, but this person is coming out to Travis Scott defense, saying that young sweet Roe, um, and Travis Scott doesn't have anything together, yada, 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 yada. However, this person needs to keep their, you know what, shut because Travis Scott needs to learn how to handle his business. Now, if you look, Young Sweet Row has photos with Travis Scott in the background. They are like inches apart from each other. How is it that you and this young lady are in the same room but you have no idea who this young lady is it's not making any sense so guys i'm including those photos for you to see the image of travis of travis scott is blurred no i realized that sloan also did a video on this and what sloan said is that he has spoken to a few of young sweet row friends and her friends are confirming that she and Travis Scott has a relationship. However, she doesn't like the idea of going public with everything. Also, initially, she had no... She, initially, sorry, she did not want to go public with this. I'm not sure what happened that influenced her. What influenced her to go public with all of this. But I think that 
it's I believe it is because Travis Scott is now saying that he doesn't know her. So Sloan is inviting young Sweet Row. If she wants to come on a show, it would give her that um, platform so that she can tell her story and provide whatever evidence she needs to provide as proof so that this man does not continue to label this woman as a liar. No, many people are saying that young Sweet Row is, sing- is telling a lie. I don't believe she's telling a lie because I'm looking at some photos. And if you look at these photos, this girl like Travis Scott has been in the same place. And it could be unjust pure coincidence that they're, they're at the same place on several occasions. That's not pure coincidence. And if you look at her, because based on what we're hearing, she has been with Travis Scott since 2013. Kylie Jenner did not have the face that she has now back in 2013. And if you look at Kylie and Young Sweet Row, they are almost identical twin. So it's kind of giving the sense that Kylie got a few tweaks here and there, you know, to look like this girl that Travis Scott really loves because they even have promise rings together. So I think that because because if they've been together for more than 10 years it means that they started dating very young and Travis Scott made her a promise in my estimation and as such when Travis Scott is now coming out to say he doesn't know who she is that really hurt her and it really hurts her deeply and as such I believe that she wants to tell her story and she doesn't want anyone to label her as a liar but guys this is gonna be really one really interesting story i think that the kardashian journeys are gonna try to shut her up give her some money but i would say to miss regine Carr, not all money is good money it's best to live in your truth speak your truth because if you don't people are gonna label you as a cloud chaser people are gonna label you as mentally ill that girl that tried to um, break up someone's home and all of that and it may affect her as well going forward in the future so i would say anyone is offering you money to shut up do not take that money speak your truth and let the truth set you free but guys that's all i want to share in this video with you guys let me know what your thoughts are about this man travis scott keep clapping back at regine carr for whatever reason, only God he knows. While you're at it, give this video a big thumbs up, share if you care, and remember, if you haven't subscribed as yet, be sure to go ahead, hit that subscribe button. Thanks for your time. Stay safe, stay blessed. See you all next time. Bye, guys.